Extra tubes and EB17 pouches are needed when running dilutions. For optimal accuracy, we recommend using a one milliliter adjustable pipette for dilution preparation. See the available accessories section of the product insert for ordering information. Also, if clarifying the sample using the filter method, remove and discard the filter after two minutes. If you get a result above the assay's maximum and want higher quantitation, you can dilute and retest the sample. The aflatoxin flex dilution range is accurate up to 300 parts per billion. To quantitate between 30 and 100 parts per billion, use the dilution protocol as outlined in the product insert for the specific matrix. In this video, we are diluting a corn sample. Prepare the dilution solution as needed by dissolving one EB17 pouch in 150 milliliters of distilled or deionized water. This can be stored according to the product insert instructions. Mix thoroughly before each use. Dilution A. Step 1. Add 400 microliters of well-mixed dilution solution and 100 microliters of clarified extract to a clean tube. Mix well. Save this diluted extract in case further dilution is needed. Step 2. Pipette 100 microliters of DB5 buffer and 100 microliters of the diluted extract from step one into a new reaction tube. Mix well. Step three. Acclimate for two minutes in the incubator. The acclimation step is only required if room temperature is outside 20 to 24 degrees Celsius or 68 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Step four, add a new test strip and allow it to react for four minutes. Step five, at exactly four minutes, remove the test strip from the tube. Cut off the tail pad and immediately place the strip in the quick scan reader. Step six, on the quick scan results screen, choose 1A under the dilution tab drop-down menu. The system will calculate and record the aflatoxin level in the diluted sample. Adjusted results are valid in the range of 30 to 100 parts per billion. If your sample results from the dilution A testing are greater than 100 parts per billion and you desire additional quantitation, you may run the dilution B protocol. Dilution B, Step one, add 200 microliters of well-mixed dilution solution and 100 microliters of the dilution A extract to a clean tube and mix well. Step two, pipette 100 microliters of DB5 buffer and 100 microliters of the new dilution B extract into a new reaction tube and mix well. Step three, acclimate for two minutes in the incubator. The acclimation step is only required if room temperature is outside 20 to 24 degrees Celsius or 68 to 75 degrees Fahrenheit. Step four, add a new test strip and allow to react for four minutes. Step five, at exactly four minutes, remove the test strip from the tube, cut off the tail pad and immediately place the strip in the quick scan reader.
Step 6. On the Quick Scan Results screen, choose 1B under the Dilution Tab drop-down menu. The system will calculate and record the aflatoxin level in the diluted sample. Adjusted results are valid in the range of 100 to 300 parts per billion.